letting you go through the torture of a public trial, um, the job of the prosecution is to throw everything at you, including the kitchen sink. So don't be surprised if uh, some of the uh, cutlery and dirty water sticks on you. I mean, you know, personally looking at everything, I wish it had never happened. I wish it never had come to trial. But the fact is that I suspect I'm the only person or the only politician at Westminster who's happy at only getting 12 votes. The, yes, indeed. <laughs> <laughs> Unless you're the Lib Dems. <laughs> uh, 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 the... The prosecution obviously made a number of accusations on the specifics of the cases against you, but did they all, you said they threw more at you, uh, wider than that, that wasn't true? No, yes, it's the, it's all, it's the character um, assassination that takes place during a trial, not just the prosecution, but clearly other people as well. And that is the job to try and make it look as bleak as it possibly is. We knew that they were throwing everything at this. I had a Treasury QC against me who was very good. I had to make sure that I had a quality of arms and got a very good barrister as well. But at the end of it, when anybody dissects your, your private life, Andrew, mm -hmm. Uh, and anybody sitting at home, just think, you're, sit, you're standing there in a dock and basically people throw everything that they possibly can, exaggerate and twist and lies, and then you walk away, yes, you walk away an innocent man, but yes, you, you're bruised, you're chastened, and some of it uh, clearly does hurt. What's it done to you? What, what's, what's, uh, ooh, what's changed? Uh, everything's changed, uh, Andrew. I, um, I think I'm far more caring than I ever was. Um, I, also, my perception, I've got to say, of the police is perhaps not what it was uh, even before the Andrew Mitchell case. Uh, and so I'm, uh, I'm a little bit more aware and weary. How were you treated on returning to the Commons? Oh, superb. And throughout the 12 months, um, I, it, everybody was absolutely brilliant on all sides. I told... Uh, uh, um, uh, Ed Miliband, that uh, his guys have been absolutely brilliant, and everybody have. I'm, 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 I've, I've had hugs from people like Glenda Jackson, uh, through to George Galloway, uh, through to clearly my own. Counselling that on you, after <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, um, and, and and David Cam. Two of these. <laughs> <laughs> and David Cameron has been absolutely superb as well. For, for just to face those allegations, one can only imagine. Uh, normally, a politician doesn't want to be accused of uh, six items in your basket when it says five items only. Uh, to get these sorts of things thrown at you, normally it's career over.